Marvin Gare. Big fan daw, pero it's the opposite, guys. Guys, fr from the previous videos, nakita niyo sobrang yaman ito, guys. <laughs> sobra, sobra. Anyways, I want to talk about money personalities. What does it actually mean? How can you put personality into your investing or money? You need to know yourself first. So in other words, how can you manage your money if you don't know how to manage yourself? Okay. So that is going to be the central focus of my talk. And this is my daughter, Gabby. Yeah. So say hi. You're in YouTube, Gabby? Yes. Yeah. The one of the best YouTube video <laughs> and YouTubers in the world. No one. But so, so you need to know your personality. But how does, how does that work? Parang how does that dictate your savings, spending? budgeting or does it dictate also what investments you can get into as you know i believe you teach this also that one wrong way of investing or doing business is to try to copy others okay. so you will see that one thing would work for someone but would not work for another person or for someone else because uh, they have different risk tolerance they have different uh, tendencies they okay. have different behaviors okay and they are actually um, well different okay so different is not spelled b-a-d okay bad. different is spelled g-o-d good which is good okay so in other words we need to know our tendencies uh, our differences so that we can also uh, match it with our personality okay you know marvin i also teach sales okay so when you say selling selling is a matching process so, for example, you have a client, you have to match that person's personality. And I believe investing is the same way. You have to match your own tendencies, personalities. Not to say that we cannot learn from others, but be comfortable with who you are and your investing methods. But you, you, this is also un underpinned with the this profiling of dominant, influential, corrective, and steady. Yes. So, for example, you are the, you are a dominant personality. How does it dictate your investing? What 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 should you do? Guys, we're in Shibuya Station, by the way. Yeah, well, uh, I think this is the busiest, oh. busiest uh, no, no, in the world. Yeah, Tama, busiest, no? busiest intersection. Yeah. Okay. So how does it dictate it? Or does it? Does it at all? Does it what? <laughs> if you are if you are a dominant personality. Oh yeah, but yeah. Um, what what investment should you at least avoid, or should you actually go into investments? Meaning Kasi, that dominant people are measure, they're measure, they don't they don't think, di ba? Parang they just act quickly. Alam natin dapat kasi yung ano natin yung personality natin. We should know our personality so that we will know our strengths, okay. and we should also know our weaknesses. Okay. And most of the time, our strengths <laughs> are actually our strengths are also our weaknesses okay. when we overuse them so for example you're a dominant then is your tendency to be more aggressive and to uh, overlook risks and it's good that because you're dominant you will uh, do whatever it takes make things happen but also your weakness is that you tend to um, minimize the the risks involved okay so you would look at the the opportunity instead of the risks and you also are more uh task oriented so bitcoin for yeah. dominant advisable not advisable i i guess that's not we can rephrase the question okay. in a different way it's a man it's a matter of um i guess not really the investment vehicle but knowing our uh investing tendencies okay. so like, let's say you're a dominant one thing that you should watch out for is you might want to go all in okay let's say so dapat the hindi, dapat hindi. oh okay oh, unless okay. they experience something uh, tragic, they experience a uh, uh, huge um, bankruptcy okay. or uh, a loss, a huge loss, then that's a time when they will start be more uh, intelligent in their investing. Okay. Now, uh, that's, that's just that's just one, not one, that's just one personality. But we'll, we'll just end with this. Paano ko? I'm an influential. Influential, tama ba? Influential yes. or... So if you're influential, you're not really into numbers. No, you're also no. Eh? You're you're a combination. Okay. You're influential, but you are also uh, corrective. Okay. So the disc D I S C dominant. Yan yung mga aggressive. Okay. Uh, influential saman. They are the people persons. Okay. And you can see, I have one beside me. It's a okay. big 
example of what of what uh you and then there's a steady the more stable one and then the corrective which is the more analytical analytical one that's why they always want to be correct okay yeah for example kuna tayo sa corrective ang mga corrective yan naman yung mga tao na uh, magaling mag-analyze they love statistics charts but the problem is that they uh, would analyze and be paralyzed because of it. So, too much analysis. Analysis paralysis. Mm. Kaya nangyari, yung tendency na, let's say, it's time for them to make uh, huge deposits in their invest investments or time to pull the trigger in one investment. Uh, they, they will they, delay uh, because they would overthink, they would okay. look for the perfect occasion. Okay, okay, okay. But there's no such thing as perfect. But that's very good because one of the biggest problems for people who are investing is analysis paralysis. Parang di, parang for just stock market application. Parang there are some people, pitong stock yung pinag-aralan, tapos lahat yun, maganda bilhin, they don't buy it because, uh, yun, analysis paralysis. Baka, baka mas maganda tong Ayala or di, SM na lang or Jollibee na lang. Uh, what do you advise for people who have analysis paralysis? How, how often does that happen? A lot, a lot, a, a lot. You will, you will see. Even, even, even. I don't know. These are people also who, for example, the more you study at times, yeah. the more you study. Because, for example, people who study charts, parang, eto buy signal, buy signal, buy signal, buy signal. Then they sila. Then they eventually don't buy at all. Uh, and it happens a lot in the market. Tan yun. Mm. How can they? How, how dun, can they? Dun mana no? Dun ka na matututo din sa ibang personality okay. types. Kasi yung type saman, you can either dial up or dial down eh. So for example, corrective ka, masyadong mataas yung corrective mo. Pwede mo i-dial down yan. Okay. So ano naman yung kailangan mo i-dial up, you can be more dominant this time. Uh -huh. Because uh, dominant, ang sa kanila ang mga risks, it's always part of the game. Influential naman, for example, influential uh, are, are the... <laughs> I don't want to, to put people in a box, but the high influentials are usually the people who are not that good with money. <laughs> Unless you're Marvin Germo, because si Marvin is iba, ano talaga outlier. Hindi, kasi si Marvin corrective din siya. Okay. So magaling siya sa tao, pero may mataas din ang anal analyzation skills niya. Okay. Pero ang high influential, yan yung mga mahina sa money. So importante sa kanila, dapat marunong sila mag forced savings mm. and forced investments. Okay. But but what, what do they when you say uh they they are they are corrective, may analysis paralysis, then you say they become dominant. What should they do? How do they shift? How do they parang decide quickly when that when those things happen? So there are two types. Okay. Una meron tayo yung short term morphing. Yan okay. yung short term kailangan mong gawin because of a situation, because of an event, or because of the people around you. Uh -huh. Meron din yung long term. Yan naman because it's part of your job and it's part of what uh, needs to be done in the long term or something that something daily, something more regular, then inapag-aaralan siya over time. So for example, okay. yeah. Uh, kasi do you also pull the plug that for example, you've been doing it already for three years, tapos you've been missing out or losing money because uh, of, an of analysis paralysis. Yeah. When do you say na, uh, it might not be for me or do you try to just learn the skill na lang to parang act swiftly? It depends also. Okay. Minsan may mga times na it's for you, but you just have to learn it. Meron din mga times na you have to move on to a more uh, suitable strategy or suitable investment for you. Okay. Kasi ito na notice ko, Marvs, yung mga dominante. For some reason, ang mga dominants kasi, mas gusto nilang nag-invest sa sarili nila. Okay. So nag-invest mag sila, kunyari, sa... Meaning they start their own businesses lagi? They, something they can control? Oh, kumaga... I, I, I don't wanna invest in this and that or minsan nga yung iba hindi ko mukha ng mga insurance hindi ko okay. mukha ng mga health card kasi okay. feeling nila their business can uh, give them all of that okay from the earnings of the business pero which is ano which is ano I'm not even a dominant person pero well, I think possible also kasi yeah kasi you control the earnings that you they want to control business. okay kasi parang ang katwira nila mm -hmm. diba o oh, stocks iba naman ang nagkocontrol niyan uh, uh, uh. eh ibang company so ako I can put up my own company okay. then it's then earn from that 100% okay. under my control okay. but eventually they will learn na kasi may mga kilala rin ako na mga super dominance mm -hmm. na wala yung negosyo mm -hmm. nakita nila na importante talaga yung diversification okay. so that's the time when they start to uh, start to be play out of character okay. kumbaga okay so they have to so the key there is if they're if they're suffering from analysis paralysis, paralysis find a different way to go out of go out of character and just find a 
ways na you can borrow from the other personalities, okay. their traits, okay. and also know your tendency. Kasi ngayon, alam mo na yung weakness mo eh, na analysis paralysis ako. Kasi maraming mga tao, we do not identify our... We, we don't know ourselves, so we cannot identify our strengths and weaknesses. Mm -hmm. But now that you know it, di ba? Parang natin, G.I. Joe. Okay. No Whoa, wing is half the battle. What's that? Whoa! Full disclosure, uh, Johnny Bravo na nabutan ko. Ayaw. Okay. Yata ako na niwala doon. So, half, no wing is half the battle. Pag alam mo na, then you have a better chance of overcoming that okay. weakness. Okay. So, I guess we'll end it We'll end it there, no? Uh, how do you avoid analysis paralysis? You... I forgot. <laughs> no, how do you overcome analysis Remind paralysis? You, uh, you do something that will allow you to skip that that trait, or you lev you leverage that because you already know ninety new strength when you find ways or find other people who can. Or you worse, can borrow from the other traits. Let's say you know you know you're corrective, so maybe I need to be more of a dominant. Then okay. you dial up the dominance, okay. dial down your corrective. Okay. So um, I think I'm gonna be talking more about that in our in the icon, mm -hmm. and it's really interesting because this is something that you can use wherever you are, whatever you do. So nilang yan sa investing, masasamay yan sa parenting, kasama yan sa love life. So on and so forth. I, I think just just to end, this is what I do. Eh. Every time I have analysis paralysis, and, and let me know if this is corrective. Now, what I do is, there are seven stocks that uh -huh. I want to buy. I I I analyze them one by one per parameter. Then, sino may pinakamadaming buy signal? That's what I actually buy. So I buy them because this one has more points than this already. Oh, Tapos para I force wrap them. The one that comes out as number one is the one that I buy lang. So at, at least it's based already on a point system na wala nang, uh, wala nang emotions doon and wala nang ano, parang there won't be a shadow of doubt because based on my point system, they're the ones that are number one. And that is an example of a corrective tarsh here. Mm. Mga nose bleed. <laughs> Yun, so, ah, talaga. So, <laughs> corrective talaga. Sabi ko, na, sabi ko na nga ba, hindi ako influential eh. Tama, di ba? Uh, Nika-influential, super influential. 